up guys, it is the Cornish Gamer and welcome back to another episode of my Civilization 5 Brave New World series as the Dutch. Anyway, um, look, have a look at the demographics as we always do. Top on literacy, top on approval, no surprise about happiness. Uh, top on GMP and top on, top on population with the Shoshone, top on everyone, uh, every, uh, everything else. We actually are second on soldiers, so when we do attack Sweden, which I believe we um, agreed to like 10 times we do attack them, then that would be interesting. The Last of Us will be coming soon. Uh, it's just because well, I haven't moved the computer in there yet. Or, yeah, I haven't moved our computer in there yet. So, that will be coming soon. Anyway, so we were just building up our army a bit to get ready for the assault on Sweden. I can see all of our units moving up. And also, we won't get a warmonger penalty for attacking Malacca because we could simply, um, we could simply, like, what should we call it? Um, liberate it? We can liberate it and we will get the warmonger penalty. Which is good. Because the warmonger penalty is a bitch. And wh whether we go on from there or not, uh, I don't really know. Alright, move up. Move up. Move up. You go there. You go there. And we got Bucharest. It's going to help us in all our city state allies. I believe we're exploring towards America. No, um, Australia, that one. Oh no, th this caravel is... Oh yeah, that guy needs to head over to America, actually. Uh, these guys want my religion, so... Convert them. Alright, that should give me some... Influence with them. Should anyway. So we're at 92 at the moment. I think our army should be big enough to take down the Swedish. If we surround them with enough, with enough crossbowmen, it should be easy enough. We've got so much money to spend as well, if we really need any more. Which I doubt we do. We're building our sea beggars. And we could try storming some coasts. That should give us some influence. Yeah, 134. Research group complete. We've almost got printing press, which means we are going to be getting the World Congress soon. A bit late for me to usually get the World Congress, but... It will be coming soon. Um, Alright. What have I set the production I order to? Crossbowmen, Dutch East India Company. Did we get the Uffizi? Or are we not researching it? No, we're going to go we'll go for economics and then we'll go to you the Uffizi. Yeah, alright. You'll move it up. You'll move it up. You'll move it up. Uh. You could you, you go scout them a bit actually. Uh does anybody else want my religion? What's my religion tenants? Plus one gold for every four followers. Yeah, we might as well spread it everywhere. All it's gonna do is give us gold. Four, twenty for Rotterdam. Ah, Rotterdam. Oh, I can't wait to get um economics and just make Rotterdam such a strong naval outpost. It already is with the growth. But with that added on to it, it's just going to be insane. Alright. We'll send our knight out to scout. Bucharest have quite an army though. Printing press. Alright. Are we going to go for prosthetics? Uh, are we going to go down patronage? Maybe we should go for that. 138 to 166. That boosts up our science. I reckon we can get another ally. Uh, he's on 80, 92, 127. Oh, it goes up in order. That's that's useful. Let's get Lasser on our side. Ah, they're already allies with the Aztecs. They're already allies with the Swedish. Let's get Kabul. Alright, that's Kabul. Allies with us now. Good. Alright, this guy's gonna head over to America. Since whoever's in South America will be pretty damn close to me, actually. I hope there's some space on Australia to colonize, though. That would be nice. We do have open borders. Yeah, when you're allies or something, you should have open borders. Alright, you're moving up. We have quite an army, though, which is good. If we compare our army. Yeah, only you know, the Swedish Empire had. 
And considering they have loads, considering they have loads of other people attacking him as well, it's pretty good. This guy can actually go to America as well. He can be like the ground scout. Nah, Kabul's mine, bitch. Ah, uh, yeah, that'll do. Oh, I pulled it. Ah, uh, yep, that'll do. Forty-one happiness though. Yeah. 41 happiness is pretty insane. So, 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 sorry I didn't upload for a few days. My brother's moving to uni and all that, and it was a bit hectic, really. But he's all settled in now, so. More uploads to come, hopefully. Walks up another bank. Hooray. Did we set a production queue? No. Alright. Yeah, we need to utilize all our trade routes, especially the cargo ships, since they earn the most. I think the Aztecs may have colonized here. May or may not, I'm not sure. See there, because they could be used against barbarians. Still, Rotterdam's a nice coastal city. Alright. Let's see what they have. Literally nothing. Oh, hello! So I remember I had fun with him in my Venice series. I mean, it wasn't as if I took down like two of the cities or anything. Anyway, he's South America. How did he get up there? With a Churim. Hmm. I'm interested. Alright, book a rest. We'll be allies with us soon. We need to renew that. Especially before the war. Uh, we're running quite a bit of culture as well, which is good. We're getting social policies pretty damn quickly. I love to look at the sea beggars though. They look so cool, like the little pirate flag and all that shit. Monsoon, yeah, literally everyone's at war with him now. A war with Aztec, Siam, Shoshone, Panama City, and Lhasa. And soon enough, pretty much every single city state. You'll pay for this in time, mate. Don't worry. I love how he's calling our empire puny when he's the one getting attacked by everyone on pretty much top on almost every single demographic. I think I should have more land than him as well. Sad man. I used to like the Swedish as well. East India Company, nice. I don't think they have colonized. They might have colonized East. Australia. Alright, I think we've just hit America there. Uh, another crossbowman. I believe I believe we made a treaty with someone to declare war on them at some point. I th may be wrong, but I swear I'm right. But this army is gonna maul them. Can't wait to unleash it on them. It's nice to actually attack someone without getting a freaking warmonger penalty every like time. Do we have them in borders with them? I'm not sure what we do. Yeah, we do. Good. Uh, I think we'll store this guy in Utrecht. Utrecht has more room to store than Rotterdam. Alright, this guy heading to America. We will lead the exploration of the New World. This guy's very close, isn't he? Yeah. I, I think the Dutch ships are the best. It, like I don't know why. I know it's only a colour, but the orange just looks so good. Ah. I'm not sure whether it has to be in a three-tile radius to be worked, but our borders have expanded to that iron, so... Uh, great writer, again. We have slots. Uh... Yeah, we do. Ah, uh, we all like to visit Amsterdam and Utrecht. Why not? Yeah, I think they may have colonized the east. I'm not sure. I don't think so, though. Oh, no, that's just Greenland. That's America. Alright. You spread it to Utrecht. Why does it take so long? It's over the road. It, said it would have taken five turns. Sorry about that. It's a guy on a bike. What a twat. Um, anyway, let's move these guys along. 
just so this guy can fit in. So I reckon this army will definitely be big enough. I was going to head this guy around here. Just to scout out a bit better. Still, I want I want more city-states, because then it'll be easier to win the vote at the end, so... Could be the city-state allies. We, al we also need to try and make our quest to find every city-state. Makes it a lot easier at the end, vote because sometimes I, I miss out on votes, because I haven't met every single city-state. Which is kind of annoying. Don't you generate a great admiral? Well, I won't be able to, sorry. We could take over. Influence of that. Oh, he's made peace with a few city states. Oh! He's made peace with Pocatello! Damn it! Damn. That is annoying. Oh well. Yeah, I don't think they have colonized it. I can see a city state there. However, there's usually two city states, so. Yep. We've hit America. Uh, great work, Mary Shelley. Ah, oh, Frankenstein. Yes. Good. Like a bit of Frankenstein. Ruins. Where did I find the ruins? Ah, oh, maybe I to get it. It's like one of those, one of those barbarian islands. All right. Alert. 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 Alright, so what do you really have is the pikeman and the composite bowman. We should be we I think it was Siam that we like I said to give us ten turns. Ah, uh, I I can't save up my gold a bit. Uh yeah, good, good. So Pocket's helping get too mad when I attack him. I was worried that because we made peace he'll be a bit mad if we attack him. You'll pay for this in time. Can we see if we made a deal with anyone to attack him in 10 turns as these guys? Might just attack him anyway, really. Amity longs for culture. Are we influence of Amity? Yeah, we are. But it should be easy enough. Our culture is really high. Right, this is Utrecht. City needs production, really. We'll try and get. I was gonna build the ironworks, but I'd rather have the ironworks in the capital. Uh let's go for the leading tower of pizza. It's very difficult once it's again. If we can get it, it'll be amazing. Hong Kong and the final sieve. See, all right, so they're in North America. They'll be able to flourish from that because there's a forest in North America. Yeah, I think I can see a city-state's borders there. All right, this is our army ready to attack the Swedish. Uh, you've met Hong Kong. I went to Longs for culture. I reckon we'll win on that part. All right, time to start getting some trade routes. Get our gold up. Soccer tie. We're in quite a bit per turn, but then at the again, that is kind of from the golden age. That's given us a bit of that. But religion. It's more people following our religion, which means more gold. I, I pretty much always go for the tight. Yep, alright. Good, it was this guy that started. I am... Did he say Zanzibar? Where's Zanzibar? Ah, no worries. Right. Oh, we're only getting a minor warmonger penalty. Minor warmonger penalty? If we attack that, liberate it. I wish we could go around and attack Sigtuna first, then Stockholm, then liberate Malacca. Oh, let's attack Malacca. Oh, yeah, World Congress. Nice. Well, we finally got the World Congress, which is a good thing. Colombo. Another city state. Good. Colombo. He says, Can I warn you? Alright. So there's 16 city states. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There's still 5 we need to meet. But we've gotten quite a few. Alright. Army. 
Alright, let's go. Dutch, move up. You go there, you go there, you go there. Alright, I reckon we have the army. Oh, we won't be able to move in with those knights because the pikemen get a bonus against knights. Make him a proposal. Uh, world's fair. They always get to go. We have the Forbidden Palace, right? Yeah, that gives us two extra votes. We have lots of votes. And at the beginning, it doesn't even count city states, so we could probably pass pretty much what we want. I say pretty much because, you know. Oh, we're going to be getting the polder improvement soon. Two turns. Great scientists in four turns. Some guys are not Sweden. Uh. It's quite unintentional. Uh, it's not. Very well. Oh, we lose 20 influence. They are friendly with us. Hmm. I'm gonna go for that because we can simply pay it off. We have the money. We we can pay it off. No Bucharest. It, it's pretty easy to pay off. Go on, go on Bucharest. Take him down. That's Kabul. Go on Kabul. Ah, uh, this is what I was worried about because that's gonna do quite a bit of damage. However, it has brought out their pikemen for our crossbowmen to fire on. Like our army's like completely comprised of crossbowmen. All right, now it's just time to buy back our influence with Bucharest. Colombo seeks investors. No longer like Bucharest, yeah. And now we are. All right, I like Bucharest. No longer like Bucharest. Yeah. Colombo seeks investors. Boom. Another ally. Well, they have Colombo. Renaissance zero. Alright, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven allies. Which is good. I've learned from my Venice to get allies a bit more earlier rather than just spamming them right at the end. Alright. You just explore around the Indonesian islands. Right, units, move up. Uh, you just have to stay there, and you move up one. Uh, you just stay there, just broke him. Alright, next turn the poles will be getting their massive upgrades, which means Rotterdam will become a super city, pretty much. Uh, yep, yeah, good. Even some guy, they, they barely even met them. Some guy only have two cities. That's a bit bad. Come on, it's ah, oh, they retreated. Damn it! He made peace with Lassa, Montezuma, Zanzibar. No, Montezuma made peace with Zanzibar. I still think people generally do hate Sweden, so it won't be too bad if I attack him. Do I still get the minor, minor. Hey, what's going on here? Only thing is, we do have to wait for our city states' turns, which is a bit annoying, really. But we have to just wait for them to move all their units, which is a bit annoying about being allies, but oh well. Trade route plundered? Where? Let's get our sea beggars to sort that out. Sea beggar, sea beggar, sea beggar. No stuff for you, sea beggar. Alright, you go sort that out. God, I thought the Shoshone would have took that down. Yeah. I'm not sure whether Australia is really habitable or not. Obviously. Oh! Look at them now, they look cool now. And look at that. Way more gold, way more production. So we're earning 141 gold outside of the Golden Age, which is great. You swap around. You move there. You move there. We could get a few units to move around here, actually. 
because we're going to have some firing here, some firing here. So we'll move these two over here. You move up, you move up. Um, may as well grab steel and then we'll go straight for the Uffizi. I hate being trade routes funded. Nah, I'm not gonna buy a cargo ship, maybe we'll just build it. In Rotterdam. Ah, the polders look so much more cooler now. Yeah, good. Oh, you can see about warmongering. Yeah. Do really? Do people really think we're warmonger? Devin, oh, you can see about warmongering, really? Wow. It's only early concerns, so it isn't too bad. But still, wow. Like, come on. Alright, fire away. Rotterdam, <laughs> Rotterdam, Rotterdam demands crab. Uh, is there any, like, gold quests? No. I always look out for the gold quests. Because they earn the most influence. Ah. Oh. Siam's so getting pillaged. Alright, you wait there. You wait there, you wait there. You take out these barbarians. Oh. Where is this barbarian camp then? Because there's a barbarian there. Surely he can have plundered the trade route. Because it said it was at sea. Alright. Let's try and find some more city states. Oh, great profit. Right. Alright, now loads of cities have adopted our religion, which is good. Also increases our gold per turn, and we're getting a great scientist next turn. Which we'll probably use to rush attack. Yeah, they'll go down. They've still got composite bowmen, man. At some point soon, we're going to be getting Gatling guns. Minor, yeah, it's still minor, just checking. Malacca should be an easy city to take down, considering the crossbowman like damage is 18. They should be easy enough to take down. Alright, great scientist. Let's just quickly go for acoustics. Rush. Then go back to steel. I just don't like to waste it just on like a tech that has one turn, it's a bit pointless really. Which one should we attack with? We'll attack with this one. I want to move them both forward at the same time while having these guys moving forward as well, so I think we'll wait until these guys are up and then just stop them from moving any units through. Ugh. There's a Bahrain camp. However, we need range ships. Oh, that one's more gold per turn. Um, you can't move up. You keep exploring the Americas. Furs, gold per turn. We won that. Why are you guarded? Yeah, he clearly doesn't like me too much. Oh, he gives us about warmongering, really, from Japan. Like, come on. Oh, we will get the liberation bonus. Um, ah, they have a trebuchet now. How much damage? It does quite a bit of damage, though. I just moved in and moved out just to quickly check. Oh, I don't like the fact they have a trebuchet there as well. That could do some damage. However, I think we'll get these crosswomen here to take down the trebuchet. Two crosswomen versus one trebuchet. Surely the crosswomen should win. Ah, uh, you open borders. How are we doing culturally, actually? Um, alright. Not amazing. Didn't expect me to, yep. Nice. Oh, the Shoshone have an army and a half. I hope they attack thing. Since Shoshone are friendly with me. Doubt they'll attack me. Trespassing in Hong Kong. Don't really care at this point. What social policies do we have available in patronage? 
Be good for that. Quality of resources increased by 100%. Happiness from gifts of luxuries increased by 50%. That'll be good. Make our happiness even higher than freaking 51. But it seeks invest investors. Vilness, 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 Vilness. Vilness, what's Vilness? Honest, we may as well take this opportunity just to give it a bit of gold. Cousin down Sweden. Uh, Amsterdam. Any gold buildings we can build? Cargo ships, actually. We want to start pumping out cargo ships out of Rotterdam. Gunpowder. No, no. Architecture for the Uffizi. How close are we to getting? Oh, Wittenberg, another city state. How close are we to meeting all the city states? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Three more city states. Which is good. Alright, let's move in these guys. Take down the trebuchet. Do we capture it? <laughs> well, very in galley, great. Keep this guy here for now. Keep this guy here for now. Actually, get the trebuchet fire on it. Don't think so, because it's forest. Alright, Caraval. You keep exploring. Um, Knight, you just stay there. You just stay there. Alright, I reckon the trebuchet will have a fire on the warrior, or my crossbowman. Probably the crossbowman. Because it's more of a threat. But could you please move that warrior out of the way, please? It's going to make it so much more awkward. Ah, okay, fine. I don't mind that. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, I'd take the gold per turn. Wittenberg and Celts now are allies. Alright, I don't mind that too much. They're not allies of us. Ah, uh, seven alliances. Lassa wants Sowism. Where's Lassa? Lassa's all the way over there. I swear we were allies of Lassa. No. Because it's quite low. Wittenberg and Celts now allies. Trespassing in Hong Kong. Yeah, well. Willem promoted. Oh, we just stole a tech from Shoshone. I suppose we were beelining a bit, so. You know, no surprise that we didn't have that. Alright. Willem promoted. Pocketel is possibly going to get a Ram Surprised by that. Alright, can we have open borders? One gold per turn, you got it for one gold per turn. What? That. I don't mind that so much. It's still pretty expensive, but we need to find all these city states. And chances are there's another one in her lands. Please move out the way. Alright, we'll move over here so we can swoop in. Alright, you go there. Galley, you head back. Did you get this guy ready to just surround it and capture some ships? Man, the Aztecs have a big army. No surprise there, I guess. We haven't actually, like, properly attacked the Swedish yet, and the episode's gonna end soon. So it's disappointing we didn't get to attack the Swedish. However, we are going to move our crossbowmen in this turn. Ah. They have musketmen. They have some pretty advanced units. In all fairness to them, we, we could probably have musketmen. Yeah, why are we... The swordsman can become long swordsman who can become musketmen. Oh, well. Yeah, we have anyway. Oh, well. New unit from Almaty. Pikeman. Thank you. We'll just keep down our city. Oh, we're getting even more happiness now. 52. Can't steal from Shoshone. Amsterdam's grown. Open borders, new unit for Alberti. Utrecht is new for, ready for a new construction project. I think I'll be competing with the Celts religion. You just stay there. You head back. And now we're going to move in our units. Oh shit, alright. So yeah? Yeah, it's this one. Yeah. I thought they moved their trebuchets back. Oh well. 
Oh damn, I thought they moved all their stuff back. Oh well. We'll try. Where's that guy there? See, I'm not so confident anymore. Just build some more happiness buildings. The golden ages will be useful. However, next turn, if a unit doesn't die, we'll be able to just maul Malacca. Yeah, I reckon this guy might die. He can pillage a tile, however. Yeah, I, was, I thought that was going to happen. Oh shit! How on earth did they manage to do that? Alright. I wasn't expecting that. Massacres of Faith, yay. Of course the Celts are going to win that one. Anyway, we'll fire on the city then we'll end off the episode. Alright, alright. Because it was a snake attack on the time. Oh dear. Surely we can do enough damage to the city. If we move this guy here as a distraction, then we can start moving these guys up. Alright, we're going to end off the episode here. Thanks for watching this episode, guys. Be sure to like, subscribe, share with your friends, add to your favourites. Oh, Mount Fuji. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.